Hey folks, Quilly Team here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play European Exiles 4 as Savory Savoy. We are currently in a war against the Papal States, although we've beaten them all the way down. And currently we're just trying to take a bite out of Portugal to see if we maybe we can grab some land there. We're still going to have to do some aggressive expansion management. So we may not just be able to go crazy with it. We shall see, we shall see. Uh, burgers, burgers. Oh, there's a bunch of peasants, holy crap. I could just spend a bunch of money, which wouldn't be so bad. Actually, it might not be a terrible idea. I think I will spend the money. That's going to be okay. Gain a core province. Trade company trouble. Ooh, that's losing a lot of points. Um, this is a particular trade zone. Oh, and then countrywide. Five years reduced trade efficiency. You know, I think that's going to be okay. It'll cost us some money, but... I don't think it's going to be that meaningful. I think we're still going to have way excess money. More than we know what to do with. How's the repairs coming? Still got a ways to go. All right. Okay, all the Diet summoned. Occupations. Ejections. Come over here. Bring the speed up by one. It's going to be okay. Lisboa is done. Now, what I'm curious about is maybe what we could do, rather than take land over here, could we get some colonial stuff? That's not bad. There's the rest of the countries in the coalition. That's odd. And do this. Are you... no oh, military access, that's fine. Alliances. I could break the alliance with Spain and Portugal. Mm, you know what? I don't think I'm going to do that. And the reason is this. I'm going to want to go with war with Spain. So right now they'd bring in Portugal, but Portugal's not really... They've just been broken so badly, they wouldn't really add that much. And this might prevent Spain from finding a stronger trading partner. So, I think we will actually not do that. I guess there's still the question of, do I want to take a province? You know what? I'm going to leave you with the, uh, with the land you've got right now. And the reason is, we don't have full uh, um, uh, administrative efficiency right now. So, we're sort, of, we're sort of overpaying for the land compared to what we will be doing later. Um... I'll just take the uh, the Papal States and call that good enough here. So we're going to send those demands. I do like that we got some stuff over here somewhere, which is going to be kind of nice, maybe. Um, what we're going to core... Oh, it flipped. Okay. I was like, what, what was going on with the coring? What do you mean I can't afford it? And why did it disappear? It's because it was territory over here, which then flipped over to my vassals. So that's excellent. Okay. Good. I don't even have to bother doing that. We're black flagged over here, but that's okay. Now, uh, the Commonwealth, the only person that's still in the war. What I'm going to do is... I'm going to get you to just group up over here, and then we'll fix you afterwards. Let's get all these ships um, just come home real quick, and then we'll figure out what we're doing next with that. You're over here. We will want more cannons. By the way, you're, ideally we want cannons to fill the uh, back line completely. Um, I'm a little worried still about attrition. Um, and so right now it's like, well, I'll just do cannons up to the next siege thing. It's almost the full combat width, but yeah, theoretically we'd want 34 cannons here, especially when we get the next level and we get more and more and more fire stuff because they just do so much damage. I mean, I think from level to something like 16 on or something like that, it does more. So... Occupied by Russia. Occupied by Russia. Maybe I'll just... Give Russia, like, two pieces of land like that. Do this, it would go to me, I think. Because it's not actually occupied. Yeah. I mean, I could give it to Russia afterwards, but it'd be pretty awkward. Take the war reps, because I'm always going to do that. Mm, military access, military access, none of that matters. Releasing some nations would cost me some diplo power. I don't think that's really what I want to do then. Give to Russia, give to Russia. 
we'll still get the aggressive expansion. But it's not much, and it's not really changing anything, so I think that's fine. And then we'll take all your money. Wow, that's a lot of money. Negotiating for themselves, yes. And I was going to say, we should go to basically 100% war. How come not full war score? Is something of mine occupied somewhere? Oh, right over here. That would be why. Yeah, all right. But that's okay. Um, why are you still showing attrition? That was weird. Sulu's entering a coalition against us. Oh, my. 63. Oh, yeah, because of the um, the 25 over there. That makes sense. And we can invest into technology. Um, it is January. Do I want to do it now? I mean, unless I'm dumping the points into something else. Well, I'm going to be doing some coring here. So, yeah, maybe we can wait a little bit. Because we're obviously consuming the entirety of the Papal States. Coalitions be damned. Done. Goodbye, Pape. Let's fix that. Okay, I was going to say, I don't think there's going to be any conversions available. And that is indeed the case. I'm going to take just the light ships out of here. I'm going to give you this. And I'm going to put you back into protecting trade in Seville, please. And thank you. I think that's going to be okay. I'm going to tell you, prepare if you're even slightly damaged. Which right now, you're damaged anyway. So yeah, you're not going to leave right away. And that's okay. Venice. Venice still exists? Oh, is this you? That's Venice right over there. Um, We don't need prestige or legitimacy. It's all maxed out. So we'll lose some prestige, but I think that's going to be okay. We do have a ton of money. Let's do a quick check here. Manufactories, nothing that's worth a ton of money. Um, we'll take a few, look at a few of these in a second. Let's check the taxation. Nothing here worth a lot of money. Let's check the production. Um, I'll do these that are worth 20. That seems like it's going to be okay. Seems fine to me. Um, let me check trade buildings. I was going to say, yeah, we probably have some really powerful ones. I don't know. Arbitrarily, something like that. We'll revisit afterwards. Um, sailors. Yeah, nothing that provides really powerful sailors. We are going to want to do these. We're not getting the full value out of these because of um, autonomy. But I am going to want... Uh, naval force limit. Now, I realize we're not actually at our force limits, most likely. Um, no, neither of these really matter, so that's going to be okay. All right, let me tell you to conform to a template and then move over here. Oh, that's only a place with more supply limit. I really have to go all the way over here. Man. You do that. Also, you should start drilling. Got some rebel uprisings threatening. Uh, oh, we don't have the money to finish that. That's okay. All right, you drill. So what are the rebel factions? Kutai. Um, I'm going to harsh treatment you. I've got the points, and you're in an awkward situation. So we're going to do that. Now, did I still have some troops over here? I guess I did. Hold on. Maybe I didn't need to squash you. I forgot I had this whole army over here. You should be drilling. And we don't have spare leaders. Um, hmm. We don't actually need the admin right this second. What's our inflation at right now? Oh, you know what? Okay, that's going to work out well. We'll do this and we'll immediately buy down the inflation. There we go. Yay, fish! That's what we needed more of. I didn't want, like, a high-value resource. Why would I want that? That would be stupid. Okay, you're in position, so you can start drilling. The Zon are doing knowledge sharing. Oh, they just still didn't have manufactories. Okay. 41 over here, but you're conforming to template, which is going to be okay. 41k over here. I'm sorry, did that say Spain on France? Is Spain on France? Spanish purge of French heresy. Oh, they're reformed! Did I know that? You don't see this very often. Uh, I can wait a tiny scooch before hitting that button. Okay, so now, how do I feel about this? Well, you're guaranteed. You're not allied, but you're guaranteed. Um, I don't see any reason why we can't just go and just completely raffle stomp all this. Right? Right. And I really want to connect this land 
and having more power in the Gulf of Aden trade node is going to be very valuable. Level 1 fort over there. Um, level 2 in the mountains, but I don't think I'm too concerned. I could move a fleet to blockade here. We actually might want to get a fleet over there because there's a good chance that we will... Um, we will experience some uh, difficulties maybe with some crossings. So I'm going to get a fleet over here. So my heavies and my transports, why not, are going to go over there. The lights, I'm going to keep them on the mission to just defend trade. That's going to be okay. Freaking Ottomans, man. Although we do have positive Diplo rep. Annexation is progressing. <gasps> At a rate of four a month. It's happening. Just done. So you just done. Oh, yeah. You stopped drilling. Um, You can keep drilling. Ulm. Oh, no. Ulm has entered. Now we're doomed. All right. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to move, say, this leader here, actually. I realize it's going to stop drilling, but that's going to have to be okay. Also, we should probably have gotten a, uh, a siege pit dude over here. I'm going to move here, and I might just stay on this tile. Do we have full siege? We do. I'm going to stay here and block any more crossings. Uh, we'll just wait until January, and then I think we'll go. Gain of stability. Well, we are not capped. And we get the theologian for missionary strength, or prestige. No, no, we'll take the stability. That works out beautifully. And I think we will be doing some conversions after some cores are finished. Because <clears throat> there's some Catholic territory. Manchu's preparing to attack Ming. Alright. Rebel factions are under control. Native stuff. That's good. More coalition. The more people enter, the more people the more chance there is someone's gonna be crazy enough to pull the trigger. Um, Fort Wise. Level six. Okay, well you need it. Okay, yeah, no, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, just stay here in case the uh, the um, Ethiopians are trying to walk through. And this is Ethiopian territory. We'd actually really like to grab Aiden here. I mean, it's literally the Gulf of Aiden. We should probably have Aiden. And it's got the trade thing, which is nice. Boring is happening. Let's go ahead and convert as well. Where we can. You guys are attritioning. Oh, these are my trade guys. Yeah, see, we really need to get some land over here, so that's less of a problem. Soon. Some point. You're locked in over there, so we may as well chase you. Although, uh, before you leave, let's give you the guy with the most siege pips. Three Level 3 siege is pretty nuts. Um, We'll detach, we'll move here. Might not dodge out of the way, because it's just a 1k stack. Might not have had the full AI. Doesn't check every day. Um, okay, yeah, we can go ahead. I'm going to grab this. And I think I am, in fact, going to go Humanism. Especially since we're clearly ahead on admin, and I did put the focus. If this didn't waste so much on Merc stuff... Uh, okay, the core creation cost is pretty good. And, I mean, governing capacity is also nice. going for it it's all that's all pretty strong there's probably some little efficiency i'm missing somewhere but hopefully it's not going to prove to be too significant jump on there siege that in terms of uh, siege percentages uh it's not so great because there is all of ethiopia out there that we are not sieging out currently but i'm not too concerned from that side I'm going to go ahead and squash this guy. There we go. Like that. We're going to do this. And then you are going to queue up a move to return there. And you're going to stay there and siege that out. Because we can. All right. Ships are here. Keep preparing for now. Well, actually. Come over here. They're going to come through here, which is fine. So we'll have the primary stuff sieged out first. Usually I actually focus on the um, the secondary people because I want to se separate piece them out first. But this is going to go okay and who knows, this might turn out to be long and annoying and then we'll have we'll happy that we've got all the, you know, the, the primary nation all sieged out so that we can piece out at the five-year count. Um, I don't really want the unrest. 
But I don't want to spend the admin since we do actually have admin ideas going. All right, coring finally is a thing that's happening. More people coalitioning. I'm gonna do that. We'll send you up there because why not? Didn't get the siege that time. More constructions soon. More of those. I'm still wondering about some of these things. We just get a lot of sailors from this too. So they've got Rosetta over here, All right? So, um, if I repair damage ships, okay, there's going to be still some left there. Not a ton, but some. Crossover. Bohemia. All right, that's coalition starting to be fairly sizable. <laughs> Wait until I peace out over here. Like the Mamluks, the Ottomans. That okay. That might be a little too intimidating. We may have to play with things. What we could do, it'll give us a little less. We could just vassalize Yemen. That might not be the worst idea. I know that, like, yeah, we're still behind on Diplotech, and that's a Diplotech cost. We're going to be putting all our admin power into ideas for a while. So, I actually think that might be pretty strong. Actually, I should... Wait, I'm going to do here. Send more guys down this way. That'd be okay. Oh, you're going to go that way? Why like that? Was there a fort in the way? Maybe this one here. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well. Heir to the throne. 443. That's not too shabby. Mowage. Move down here. We've got the blockade for this fort, so that'll help some. This isn't the guy with the siege pips, but that'll have to be okay. We're doing some fighting over here, but nothing I'm worried about. So, um, where am I force limit wise now? Because I have built a bunch of dudes, but I suspect we're not yet there. Oh, we're actually basically capped. We're at 315 of 322. I'm like, should I build another army? And the answer is, well, I mean, maybe, but no. Commonwealth is having big problems. That's really nice to see. Spain is all up in France's grill, although it looks like grill France may have won some battles and then forced Spain out. 72 over here, 69 there. Um, and this is one of the places, yeah, I'm improving this fort. It's flat land, which isn't ideal. Actually, do I care about the fort here? It's not ideal, but it really helps to control the entranceway to Spain here. You know what? We'll do it. We've got the money. It's okay. I might still want to build one here in the Highlands. We've got a tech that is military. Since I'm not actually worried about the fighting that's happening right now, I'm going to wait and hope that it gets a little bit cheaper. Um, although, we might get into some serious fighting soon enough. We have a full cannon bonus there. We do. I do have to wait for this to pop, though, before we go to the next um, the next place. Not basically... Oh, well, except for the general. Hold on. Let's do that. Um, I'm going to move everyone over here and just this guy here, which still has the general attached to it. We're going to move in there, so that's going to add three siege pips, which is going to be really handy. Okay, attrition, attrition, siege one. Let's send you... Oops. Let's send you back over there. Let's send you down over here. We'll just siege, siege out various stuff, and actually, I'm going to send this army to the capital. Actually, maybe what I'll do is I'll send you over here. I'll move the ships here. We'll quickly eject these guys. Oh, my little singletons. I'm sorry, I forgot about you. Um, yeah, that's good. And they'll desiege that, but it's not a fort, so it's not terribly meaningful. Now, they could probably desiege this. Yeah, it's only fort level 2, which wouldn't be hard, but... I think we'll just keep doing what we're doing, and I think that's going to be okay. I could move some more guys in here. We've just got so many people just idle over here. But I think... Ooh, that's Spain going back and forth. France may, in fact, be screwed. Honestly, I'm just happy that they're, like, wasting their energies on each other. That's just really, really good for me. Um, I want to true faith, which is going to help with some of our um, crankiness problems. Then we get the other way around. Yeah, we'll, we'll take the hit to innovativeness. Sort of a double hit because we also don't get the discount, right? So it's like a 20% swing. France wants military access. Sure. 
might want to move my troops out just because they're going to be fighting on top of where I'm sitting and giving me attrition. It's surprising how low of, um... Well, actually, go there, and you just shuffle down this way. Surprising how low the uh, supply is over here. So I know we're sort of doing an economy run, basically, with our troops, but I think that's fine. Like, we could really be putting more people in here, but overall we're okay. And maybe what I want to do is just peace out now. Uh, with Ethiopia, am I at least 10% with you? Yeah, but you don't even want to white peace. Okay. I might be able to what, just negotiate with Aiden and just take, you know, or Yemen, sorry, and then take this and vassalize you. They're not willing to do it. And then do this. But we will have to do a little more. That's no, okay. Boom. Boom. Yes, we're kind of far away for a lot of our vassals to come and help. Um, that's military. We're still going to wait a little bit longer on that. Coast has been raided. Da 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 da. Idea. E um, let me wait just because we might want it for coring. I still think I kind of like the idea of doing the vassalization thing, but we will see. And I suppose these sieges finish on this tick. They did not, but well. Move over there. So yeah, they're sieging out some stuff, but hardly any. Certainly not at the same rate I'm doing it. Excellent. Hurrah. Let's go over here to Shawa. Come over here and actually let's move our ships over to there. And then what we'll do is we'll swing over here. Just looking to get those sinks as much as possible. Um repair damaged. Yeah, there's not too many broken ones. Good, good, good. We can always pop them out to go and fight over here. I think they were assigned to my um, trade fleet, which is okay, but we'll want a little bit of this. Lost claims. I'm going to cancel the counter espionage. I'm going to build a spy network on Provence. To regain those so we still have the option of pulling the trigger at some point. Come over here. Repair damaged. Repeat. Lost the siege of Sinai. Oh, we can purchase another ability. Um autonomy chain. I mean we don't really hit this da, 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 devastation. I don't know. In case we decide to do autonomy changes, maybe. Yemen wants to peace out. Well, let's get back to you on that, buddy. We might still want to separate peace out Ethiopia first, but you know what? Honestly, it might just be okay to do this. They are working on desieging that, which I think is fine. We may need it. Oh, you need a reinforcement tick. Let me just do this. Come back over there. Uh, you've done that. that that's fine. We'll go and re-siege it soon enough. On the Siege of Shawa. Oh, I'm going to swing back this way. Are we really attritioning so fast that I can't reinforce? Quickly enough here? The cavalry over here, just in the interest of speed. We can break them apart and de-siege along the way. Devastation Siege of here is over. Problem is, I want to have my boats in position. Well, I guess they'll just get kicked out. They'll dock somewhere else, and that's going to be fine. Uh, detach. Detach. Okay. Waiting for January. They're done there. Uh, is there another fort over here? Not at a glance. Those are not the enemy forts. So we'll just come way over here and de-siege some of my stuff. Colony over here, self-sustaining. Doom! Go to Lay. Move you there. Italian Malukas. Malukas, that's really great. And we'll just make sure to... You know what? We got some modifiers to this quickly. Let's do that real quick. That's going to be okay. Ethiopia eager to peace out, and oh, we are capped on our military now. Really? Oh, I guess it did blow through that other January. Um, I'll do it now. We could spend it somewhere else and do something, but that's going to be okay. Um, we're not about to fight. 
Let's get the new mortars. Awesome. Maybe do some states as well. We'll take a look shortly. Boop those guys some more. And, ooh, that was a full boop, I think. Let's jump on these guys. Going down the coast there. Meanwhile, you're coming up over here. All right, Ethiopia. All right, I have 61% with them, which is great. I want Aiden. Do I want anything else? Well, who owns this? Oh, I do, right? Yeah. Um, Zalia is a center of trade. Do something like this. Any others? Well, way down here. On the Gulf of it in trade node, which is kind of nice. Um, what I think I'm going to do is I think I'm just going to work my way up the coast. Now, does this change anything? Rothberg, Constance. No, it's not changing who would join the coalition right now. Um, that's as far as they're willing to go. I could push it some more, but I think that's going to be okay. Um, that still doesn't really change any of the math here, which is great to see. Not tribute. Give up claims and things. Uh, transfer tra Oh, you're at our limit here. Okay, I think this is going to be fine. Do this. Uh, let's core first. Thank you. And we're at 93% with Yemen. Um, we're gonna, we'll retake some of this, though. You go over here. Ships. I think you're going to make the long trip back over somewhere in core Italy. Oh, we can't core you right now because I think you're out of range, but you'll be fine afterwards. So we'll just convert Aiden it's over here. Well, actually, why can't we core this? Oh, we're at war with another nation that has a core there. Yemen has this as a core. We'll be able to... We could flip this back to Yemen. Um, Maybe after we convert it, we just give it to Yemen. I kind of like that. And you're here. And they still have some of the stuff sieged out. Not that it's going to matter. Um, Yeah, I think we'll invest in the humanist ideas. Boom. Okay. Because I don't think we're going to be doing some coring over here. I mean, maybe we'll just core Aiden. It might be cleaner. Almost done annexing Mali. Finally. Took a while. It took a long, long, long time to be able to get there. Oh, I can stay over here. Uh, there we go. Great company. I was saying, no, I don't want to stay over here. I want this to be a trade company, which is fine. The so 31% trade in Malacus. Um, and over here. And by default, I think it will be transferring trade, which is good. Um, Carmondel, Clark doing much, but it's still where we want you. Although, we could actually trade probably better. Yeah, we have no trade power. If we move you, transfer trade power. So instead of Coromandel... We'll transfer trade here and we'll send it directly to the Cape of Good Hope. Actually, that's not really where we want it to go, is it? Take a local autonomy. Hmm. I mean, it will funnel through here into Seville where we are yanking a good amount of money out of it. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Integrated Molly. Yay! Done. 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 Um, add to trade company. I will maybe. How do we? Safi versus Ivory Coast, which doesn't matter because either way it goes to Seville. I think we still trade company you, and in fact, any chance we're getting some extra merchants out of this? as such 
Now, there's plenty of trade company investments and things we could do, too, in some of these areas. Although, we've got the valuable buildings down. Goods produced and stuff. I don't know. we got plenty of places to throw our money. Uh, building Spy Network in Provence. Let's go fabricate claim on there. And maybe I'll, I'll pull you out now. So our diplomats are coming home, which is great, because we're going to counter espionage on the Ottomans again. And I might counter espionage on Spain, because I think they were one of the others who had done some stuff. Although I'll probably pull one back soon uh, so that we can grab Yemen here. Uh, let's go and take out these peasants. Still 98. We could probably just piece them out unless we want to wait. Uh, yeah, it's vassalize and then... I don't think this changes anything in terms of who could join a coalition. It's not going to help us break it, but it's going to be fine. Um, I might want to just take their money to make it so that they can't rebuild their army as well. I think that's exactly what's going to happen. And I will peace out now, because then what's going to happen is I'm going to move over here. I'm going to kill those guys, which is going to help our relationship. Right now, you are super cranky. Um, but how cranky are you? 65% isn't so bad. I'm going to give you Aiden. I'm also going to make you like me from just killing your rebels, which is going to be nice. Yeah, I'm going to cancel one of these. Because we're going to need a diplomat assigned here. Innovativeness, sure. A little bit of unrest. But that's going to be okay. Yeah, boot these guys. You're being attritioned on the way. Oh, yeah, because you're doing stuff over here. Um, any chance you'd be interested in selling me a province? I know we've, like, looked at it before. Um, Carter Company. Like, I don't know, here. From our closest unblocked core province with a port, okay. 11,000. Oi. They hate me. Oh? Well, why can't I set this higher? Must be capped to their particular income or something? Oh, I can just look for green. Okay. What's the deal with the blue one? Hold on. Oh, is it their capital? It's their capital, so I can't ask them. Um, but they'd be willing to give me some. And I think it's well worth grabbing just anything at this point in this area. Gives us a toehold. Over here. Um, it's in this trade zone. It's been added to the trade company, which is nice. Some of these places might be more valuable, but that's okay. We can get there. Um, we really don't need a church over here. I might want to get a fort. Like grasslands. I mean, it's not ideal. I don't know if it matters. Okay, but it's a toehold. We'll keep checking when we've got money for things that are green. If I'd realized sooner that I could just look for green places. Oh, man. Yeah, that would have saved some annoying work. Uh, right, okay. You guys are supposed to be little individuals. You and you don't have to be here. Um, we inherited some ships over here. I'll go ahead and upgrade you. That's fine. Um, are we over our, our military force limit since we didn't inherit some stuff? We're exactly, 100% exactly at our force limit. Well, that's interesting. We still have air as a vassal, so we still have to go and, uh, and, and get a hold of that at some point. That's for sure. But we've done some pretty aggressive expansion here. We can probably afford to just be, wait, wait for a tick. Although we're manpower cap. Incredible to me. That we just keep sitting at this manpower cap like this. Um, you're done over there. How's the... If I were to... Rebel Stomp. Oh, yeah. Um... Hang on a sec. I'm going to... Yemen. 
Grant Province, Eden. Boom. Okay. Oh, I was gonna wait until I was done converting them. Man, my memory is short. And improve relations over here. But yeah, I'm not too worried. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna send both these guys up to here. Oh, military advisor's gone away. 5% discipline is good, and we do want to level 3. Uh, we don't have any half-priced dudes or anything like that, so that's going to be okay. At some point, the Ottomans have to be stopped. Suddenly. I don't know if now's the time, but at some point for sure. You are going to go protect trade in Seville, where hopefully you'll merge up with the other fleet that's already doing something very similar, although I think the other fleet is currently repairing. Mm hmm 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 Go. And then this one is still getting a little bit of work on as well. Start bringing you in. Muslim chiefs, religion changes. That's not a big deal. Boom, boom, boom. Well, I have to put a cut in here. 1670. So we got what? About another 150 years to go, right? And the rate at which things happen accelerate. I think Italy's going to blob up very big in the next little bit, but it's possible my overall tempo's not where it should be. It's it's hard to pick out exactly. Um, oh, let's get that one in Pisa. We must have been building other things before. Um, let's increase you. And we still don't have a lot of sailors, and we're gonna. We actually, I don't think we're at a naval limit, so we're going to want more sailors overall. We may, in fact, end up building. A few more of these buildings, like the Sailor Boost over here, which gets better in certain areas, but we may have built manufactories in most of those, so that might be part of the issue. Um, manpower modifier. You already have the basic building, so we'll do that. All right, and spend all our money. And that seems totally okay. And we're going to pop up now. It'll be something that I want to spend money on. We'll have to take a loan, but it's not like our economy is really going to suffer that much if we did take out a loan. You should be drilling... Um, you're just sitting here for now, so drill for a little bit, and that's going to have to be okay. And then you're on the move. What I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the leader. I'm going to assign the leader over here, and then get you a drill. Okay, we're going to wrap it up here. Folks, thanks a lot for watching. I'm going to see you guys next time. Bye-bye.